In this video, you are going to learn three powerful navigation features in Power BI that can completely change the way you build and explore reports. We will cover drill down function, which is to explore data inside a chart. Then we'll see custom hierarchy to build your own drill path other than the date hierarchy, which is an inbuilt feature of Power BI. Then we'll see drill through, which is to jump from one page to another with filtered details. By the end of this video, you will be able to turn simple charts into fully interactive insights without creating extra pages or visuals every time. This video is going to be best for the beginners. Let's start with the drill down. I have added a basic bar chart with amount on the Y axis and date hierarchy on the X axis. X axis has a transaction date with year, quarter, month and day. Y axis has amount column. Right now the chart is showing totals by the year. And if I click on the bar for 2023, nothing happens. Why? Because the drill down is turned off by default. Let's turn it on. At the top of this visual, you will see this few buttons. Okay. And you'll see this down arrow. This is click to turn on drill down. When I click this and now our bar chart has become become interactive. Now when I click on 2023, it will take me to 2023 quarter wise data. And when I click on quarter one, it will further take me to Jan, Feb, March. And when I click on Jan, it will further take me to the days. This is how the chart has become very interactive with this just one drill down feature. Now let's look at the other two buttons. This one is go to the next level in the hierarchy, which has two separate arrows. When I click on this, it will take me to the next level, like from year to quarter, but hides the previous level. It doesn't show the year. And when I further click on these two arrows, it will take me to the month wise, but it doesn't show which quarter they belong to. And which year they belong to. Let's look at this button, which is expand all down one level in the hierarchy. This one has two connected arrows. It shows both level at the same time. Like when I click on this, now it will show me 2023 quarter wise, 2024 quarter wise. And when I further click on this, it will show me months while still seeing the full breakdowns. When I click further, it will take me day wise. So this is what is all about drill down. Now let me come here and show you quickly one thing. Suppose I have this chart and this feature is open. Check then. Now when I click on the 2023, you can see this also get changes. When I click here, you see this got changed. When I further click here, this got further changed. Now suppose you don't want the interactive chart between these two when this is on. So it's very easy. Go to the format and instead of entire page, just click on selected visual. Now when you see, if I click on 2023, nothing changes on the second chart. Now let's work with the custom hierarchy. Let's say you're not working with the dates and maybe you want to explore data like this. Expense category, subcategory and department. We can create our own hierarchy for this. Come to your data, come to the expense category right click on these three ellipses and click on create hierarchy and you see a new hierarchy appeared. Now do the same thing for your expense subcategory. Do a right click and add to hierarchy expense category hierarchy. And when I scroll down, you will see expense category is added and expense subcategory is added. We'll do the same for department. I'll do a right click, add to hierarchy, add to category hierarchy. And you will see department is also added. Nothing is changed to the original one. The original ones are intact. Only thing is you got the new hierarchy. When I click here, okay, click on the data. I'll remove the transaction date and I will get this expense hierarchy. I have a client meeting and when I click on this, I'll click on client meetings. It will take me to the gift refreshments and venue. When I further click on it, it will give me the department wise. So this is how you can create your own hierarchy. Now let's talk about drill through a feature that lets you jump to another page with detailed data based on what you click. Let's say we have a bar chart that shows total amount by expense categories. If I click on the client meetings, I want to see which employees were involved, subcategories, amount, all in one clean table. And here's how to do it. We'll create a new page and name it drill through detail. In this, we will add a simple table showing all those information what we need. We want employee name, subcategory, payment type, amount. Okay, this is our data. So whenever I click on the client meetings, I should get information regarding this client meetings here. Only the employee names related to the client meetings and all their details. That is our goal. Now I'll click on this page here, not on the visual. I'll click on the page. I'll click on this format. I'll come to page information. The name of our page is drill through details. Page type I'll choose drill through and I'll add a data which we had in our expense category. What we had we had expense category. So I'll add it and I'll also take a card. Why I'm taking a card? Suppose when I click on the client meetings and go to a drill through page, I should get here. Okay, I'm looking at the client meetings. I should not get confused. So I'll take a simple card. Okay, I'll make it little bit small. And in this, I will add again the expense category. And if I want to format it little bit, I can go a format. I can just come here. I can click here and come to the category label and off it. And you have also noticed when we took this drill through page, our back button is automatically added. Now, if I want to go back, I can just press control and click here and I'll come back. And now I'll do a right click and you see a drill through option is coming and drill through options takes us to drill through details, which is our next page. 
So when I click here, you will see client meetings and related to client meetings information. And if I want to go back, I can just press control and click on this back button. Suppose if I want to see for the meals, I do a right click, drill through, drill through details and you will see the card shows meals and meals data is here. So that's it. In one video, we covered three super useful features, drill down, custom hierarchy, drill through. These are the simple to set up, but make a huge difference in how you explore and present data in Power BI. I just learned it. So I thought, let me share it with you. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much.